and welcome to Toddler Storytime with Miss Natalie. This week we have some really fun books and songs to sing with you, and I am so excited for our story time. This week our story time is called Everyone's Special, a Pride Story Time. In the month of June, we celebrate everyone for their differences, and that's what makes them them, and that is just so great. Because everyone's different from everyone else, and that's okay. You can be different from your friends, from your grown-ups, from your teachers, and from people that you see outside, but you are still special just the way you are. Before we get started, let's do some nice morning stretches to wake up our bodies. Are you ready? Let's reach your arms way up really high, and touch our toes, and let's touch our head and our nose and our ears. Let's reach our fingers out in front and wiggle our fingers and then make really, really tight fists. And then stretch your fingers out really, really wide and squeeze your fingers, stretch them out wide. Give yourself a big, big, big hug and look up to the sky and look down at your knees. And let's clap three times. One, two, three. Let's clap our hands into our laps and get started with our first story. In this story, we are going to read about a piggy who wants to be something a little different in our book called Piggy Bunny. <coughs> in this book, friends, we are going to read all about a piggy who wants to be something a little different from the other pigs in Piggy Bunny. Liam was just like all the other little piglets, piglets except for one thing. All the other piglets wanted to be pigs when they grew up. Liam wanted to be the Easter Bunny. Oh, there he is dreaming about the Easter Bunny. Liam tried to practice hopping. He tried to enjoy salad and he tried to deliver eggs. The Easter Bunny asked Liam's big brother. Seriously? Yes, said Liam. You are a piglet, said Liam's big sister. Deal with it. I am dealing with it, said Liam. Liam was dealing with it by trying to practice hopping and trying to enjoy salad and trying to deliver eggs. You are a terrific piglet, said Liam's mom. We love your squiggly tail and your little black eyes and your snouty nose and your adorably triangular ears. You are perfect, said Liam's dad, just the way you are. Just the way I am, said Liam, is a piglet who is going to be the Easter Bunny. Do we even believe in the Easter Bunny, asked Liam's little sister. Ugh, said Liam's dad. We are more of a believing and oinking family. I believe in the Easter Bunny, said Liam. When Liam's grandparents came to visit, everyone said, oink, oink, can you oink like a pig? Oink, 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 oink except Liam. Liam said, hello, my name is Liam and I'll be your Easter Bunny. Bunny, asked Liam's grandpa. Did this piglet just say he's a bunny? The Easter Bunny, Liam exclaimed. Oh, said grandpa. He doesn't look like a bunny to me, said one of the neighbors. All the pigs and piglets stared at Liam. He didn't look like a bunny to any of them. Of course he doesn't look like a bunny, said Liam's dad. He looks like a perfect piglet. And he doesn't have to try to be anything else, said Liam's mom. That's our piglet, and we love him. Liam felt loved, but he also felt sad. Everybody was sure he could never be the Easter Bunny, and Liam knew they were wrong. But he wondered a little bit. What if they were right? Liam sighed. This is the kind of problem, he said, that is called heartbreaking. Poor Liam. Baloney, said Liam's grandma. They just have the imagination of a kumquat. That's a fruit, a lot of them. She shook her head. Go put on your Easter Bunny suit, Liam, then they'll see. Liam blinked his little black eyes. But Grandma, he said, I don't have an Easter Bunny suit. Liam's grandma smiled. This is the kind of problem, he whispered, that's called fixable. Liam hopped around his grandparents, his triangular ear, ear, ears twitching with excitement. You know how to make an Easter Bunny suit, he asked. Absolutely not, said Grandma, but we know how to order one. While he waited for his Easter Bunny suit, Liam kept hopping, eating salad, and delivering eggs. He got pretty good, although liking salad was still a challenge. And when his suit arrived, Liam tried it on. One 
Gun Gong Bunny ears had trouble standing up, and it was a little big in some places, and a little small in other places. And it was itchy. And Liam looked in the mirror, and he didn't see the string hanging down, or the wobbly ear, or the two long sleeves. He even didn't notice the itch. Because what he saw in the mirror was Liam the Easter Bunny. He smiled and whispered, yes. Off he hopped, delivering eggs. And everybody believed in him. Oh, well that was so cool, Liam's family. Well, his grandma and grandpa bought him an Easter Bunny suit so he could be whatever he wanted to be. That was so nice of them. I think he'll be a very good Easter Bunny. Friends, for our first song, I look kind of far away because this is a sitting up and standing up and sitting back down song, and I want you to be able to see me do it with you. Are you ready to sing our song together? We're going to sing about some fun things that everyone likes to do together. Are you ready? One, two, three. We'll wave hello together, together, together. We'll wave hello together because it's fun to do. We'll clap along together, together, together. We'll clap along together because it's fun to do. Now can you stand up? Ready? We'll bounce around together, together, together. We'll bounce around together because it's fun to do. Now, are you ready to dance? Now we'll dance around together, together, together. We'll dance around together because it's fun to do. And my favorite, we'll twirl around together, together, together. We'll twirl around together because it's fun to do. And finally, We'll sit down together, together, together. We'll sit down together because it's fun to do. And last but not least, can you make a heart? We'll love together, together, together. We'll all love together because it's fun to do. Good job, friends. I love each and every one of you for coming to my story time and being the sweetest friends. Did you know, friends, we have a Christmas parade and a 4th of July parade and a Thanksgiving Day parade? Not in Coronado, but all their places. But we also have something called the Pride Parade where we celebrate everyone being different. And we're going to follow one puppy as he goes through the day called Pride Puppy. Oh, look, there he is. That's a cute puppy. A for awake, animals and all. B for breakfast and baby, and for ball. C for car, our old Chevrolet. D is for doggo, dress for the day. E is for everyone under the sun. F is for feathers, for flags, and for fun. Oh, look at there's a rainbow there. Just like what we read in our song. G for grandma at our meeting spot. H for at. Hungry and woo, hot. I is for ice cream, sticky and sweet. J is for joining the crowds on the street. That man's juggling. That's something cool. I wish I could juggle. K is for kindness and friends that we're keeping. L is for leash, for loose and for leaping. Uh-oh, the dog is getting away. M is for missing. We search high and low. N is for nearly, and next time, and no! O is for oops, our hopes are fading. Oh no, where's the doggy? P is for puppy, proudly parading. There he is, we found him. Q is for queen in a beautiful dress. R is for rainbows and a really big mess. S is for school bus and students with signs. T is for teachers and toddlers in lines. U is for umbrellas with colors so bright. V is for victory. We found him and holding on tight. They better hold that leash. W is for wags and white smiles all around. X is for oh, exhausted, asleep on the ground. Y is for yaws as we drive. 
drive away. And Z is for zzz at the end of the day. And that is the end of our alphabet dog story. That doggy sure took his owners on a wild chase all around the parade trying to find him, but I'm glad they found him in the end. And in this song, friends, we are gonna learn all the colors of the rainbow together and sing about them in the order they go. Do you know the colors already? If you do, you're gonna really love this song. And if you don't, you're gonna learn a whole new thing in this song and I'm so excited. Are you ready? Let's count, let's count all the way to five. Can you do it? One, two, three, four, and five. Take a strawberry, put it in a pot, stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest red that you ever did see. Next up, take an orange, put it in a pot, stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest orange you ever did see. Next up, take a lemon, put it in a pot, stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest yellow you ever did see. Now, this might be kind of gross. Take some broccoli, put it in a pot, stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest green that you ever did see. Now, let's take Take some blueberries, put it in a pot. Stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest blue that you ever did see. We're almost done friends, only two more colors. Take a grape and put it in a pot. Stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest purple you ever did see. Only one more, are you ready? Take some cotton candy, put it in a pot. Stir and stir and stir it up. Take it out and what do you see? The prettiest pink that you ever did see. Good job, friends. That is the order of the colors of the rainbow. It goes red, orange, green, blue, purple, and I like to put pink in too. I hope you like that song and taking all of the colors of the rainbow with me. Thank you for joining me for our Everyone is Special prize story time. I hope you enjoyed learning what makes everybody special and singing our fun songs about the colors in the rainbow and all the things that we can do together. And remember, even if you're different from other friends or people, you are still special just the way you are. I can't wait to see you next week. Bye!